Hello everyone and welcome back to another Schlub on Switch video. Today we are finally unboxing Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet. Now, I know you're wondering, it is, at the time I was filming this video, it is February. Why am I unboxing these, these games when they came out in November? Now, I wanted to get the Steelbooks for the Pokemon Scarlet and Violet from the Europe. And I decided to get the games from South Africa because I didn't have any games to South Africa yet. So I made an order from Nintendo South Africa and... They were very nice, and after a few weeks, I'm like, where are my games? Why haven't they been delivered? And they're like, oh, let's try delivering them again. And I got Pokemon Scarlet delivered. Now, they didn't deliver to me in the U.S., they delivered to my cousin who was in school there. Now, they only delivered Pokemon Scarlet with a pre-order bonus Pokemon card pack. They never actually included the Pokemon Scarlet Steelbook. And then when I emailed them back, they never responded. I'm like, where's my Violet? And they're like, oh, the Steel... Oh, sorry, first they're like, the Steelbook's going to come in a few weeks. And we're going to send out Violet again. The Violet will include the Steelbook. But Violet never showed up. A few weeks later, I'm like, where's my stuff? And they're like, what's your order number again? And I like, gave them my order number. And they're like, eh, let's not respond to this person. So a few weeks later, I emailed them again. And they're like, what's your order number? I gave them my order number. And like, eh, let's not respond to this person. So I went to them like, what the hell? Contacted in my bank. I'm like, I ordered this shit. Never got it. They're ghosting my emails. You know, sent my bank screenshots, and my bank gave me the money, my money back. Meanwhile, my cousin still had Pokemon Scarlet and the card pack. So he came back recently to the U.S., and he gave me these. Now, I went to Israel, and while I went to the Nintendo Israel, Israel store in Tel Aviv, I'm like, hey, do you have the Steelbooks for Scarlet and Violet? Because their games are based off the European region. And they're like, we have Scarlet, but we don't have Violet anymore. And they're like, you know, if you want the game, Steelbook, you have to buy you know, Pokemon Scarlet. I'm like, hey, can I buy Pokemon Violet and get the Steelbook? Because I already have Pokemon Scarlet. I actually have two copies of Pokemon Scarlet because I also have from the double pack, which I sold my copy of Violet from. And like, okay, you know what? Fine. Because we're not really officially giving the Steelbooks out anymore. But, you know. So I bought Pokemon Violet and I got my Steelbook for Scarlet. Now I just need the Steelbook for Violet. And that is the only Steelbook I am missing. Now, another thing that's interesting, with the Pokemon games, every gen of Pokemon... <laughs> I have from a different region. So the first one with Pokemon Let's Go, I have US and Japan for um, Pikachu for Japan, Eevee from US. Um, then was, what was the one? anyways, I have from Korea, I have from U UK, I have from, um, I don't remember where else. Anyways, uh, so I wanted to have something new. I was going to do South Africa for this region, um, but that didn't completely work out, so we have a mix of South Africa and Israel, even though these are Green Triangle, your Peggy games, which is basically the UK, but still, these came from different regions. So anyways, after all that ramble, let's get into this. So first, let's open up our South African Scarlet. Now, it is Peggy with the Green Triangle, and they just have a sticker on the plastic for their rating, and there's like a tracking number barcode on the side there. So this is all on the plastic. Let's take this rating sticker, whatever it is. Hold on. Let's get my scissors and cut this out. Take our Scarlet. Don't look. All right, you totally can't tell anything there, right? All right. Anyways, now that that's done, Pokemon Scarlet. We got the front here. We have the spine, and we have the back. A vibrant open world awaits. A new Pokemon Boundless Adventure. The kinds of, of Pokemon that that will appear, the likelihood of certain Pokemon appearing, the people you'll meet during your adventure, and other elements differ between Pokemon and Scarlet and Violet games. Players of either version can communicate battle and trade with either version. We got some screenshots, info on the bottom. Inside, we have received a special Pikachu as an early purchase bonus. You can 
receive this up until Tuesday, 28th of February, 2023. Hey, that is like soon. It's not a, you're still in that range. Cool. I can do that. And we have this really cool inner artwork and we have the cartridge there. So let's grab the cartridge and let's grab my switch and let's pop the cartridge in the switch. And we get the icon for the game over there. We have version 1.00 on cart, and there is definitely going to be an update. And let's check for points. And we got 60 points for this, so that's awesome. Yay, points. And let's cancel this download because I don't actually want to download it. Yes. All right, so that is Scarlet. I will eventually play these games. Now, before we move on to Violet, let's open our Pokemon pack, card pack, that came with this. This is a Sword and Shield Lost Origin fun pack. Three additional game cards. So it's not like a full pack, it's only like three cards. But yeah, let's get this open. I don't really collect cards, so let's see what we got in here. We got a Spinarak, a Litwick, and a uh, Blipbug, which this one's a little bit shiny. So yeah, those are the cards I got. Cool. Let's put these in the case because that's just where we're going to keep them because they came with the game. Anyways, let's move on to Violet. So now Violet is the one I got from the Nintendo store in Israel. Now on the front, they just have the Peggy rating. On the back, we have a bunch of stickers. We have a barcode with the price, and they just put like a sticker to show that you bought it. And here's like their rating warning stuff. So we're going to take the plastic off. And we're going to cut out this rating sticker, not the other sticker. I don't really care about the barcode sticker. But let's just cut out the ready the rating sticker. This is my third game now from Israel. Because this third time I've been to Israel since the store opened. The store there is fun. I had a really fun time this time visiting the store. And talking to one of the employees about Kiseki for an, over an hour. Ha. That was fun. And let's put the sticker there. Anyways, there we go. Pokemon Violet. Vibrant open world awaits. Same thing as Scarlet. We have the front there. We have the same insert. And we have the same inner artwork. And we just have the cartridge. We have our EUR cartridge. Let's, you know, grab the cartridge. Pop it in the Switch. Now, whenever I do eventually get to this gen, I will probably play Violet. Origin 1.00. We have the update. And we get... 60 points. Yay. And now let's cancel the update. No, I don't want to start the software. I want to download. Cancel. Download. Okay. All right. Great. Cancel. Download. Download. Canceled. Whatever. Whatever English works. And let's check out the steelbook for the last part of this video. And whenever I get the Violet Steelbook, I will be showing that off too. But meanwhile, I have these. So we got the back with the icon there. We have the front with our legendary. Nothing on the on the spine. And inside, we got some cool logo artwork. So yeah, this is a nice Steelbook. Anyways, yeah. So let me know what you think of this games if you play them, and let me know what you think of the Steelbook. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. As always, if you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications for future videos. And have a great day. Thank you. Bye.